It's a marriage these days seems scary. I don't really know what to get myself into. Sometimes. Sometimes. And personally, I don't I think know. you ever know what to get in yourself. Remember the thing. I know what someone they who's not her? happy in their marriage, and just because they don't want to, they said they don't want to hurt the person they're sitting in the unhappy marriage, and both persons are un very much unhappy. Oh but my. just because they don't want the um, what is the name? People to look on them anyway because they're Christians and everything. Look, oh, why? Why they're unhappy in their marriage? Wait, but the thing is, do they even want to fix it? Because sometimes, exactly. like, you really just and like that's the reason I'm scared because. You can be in love with somebody for so long and on a rap so good and then one day the person can get up and just change their Switch. Yes. And that's mm. so scary to me because I've devoted time, effort, energy and there are probably things that, you know, like we did give up or whatever because of love or for you or sacrifices that I made just to compromise on all of that and then, you know, like one day you get up and you're like, yo, like... I don't want this anymore. Like mm -hmm. I don't, I don't feel the same as how I did a year and a half ago, or something. and that's so scary to me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's really scary. So like especially scary. if you and them just for so long, super scary. And then they, they, they were them to sick and thing. Mm -hmm. And then all of a sudden, when they get married, it is a totally different story. Yeah, and like, what about the people who? You and them, they all long and you are too thick and thin and you do things, make sacrifices, blah blah blah. And this has been going on for years and then when you finally part ways, the man find the next girl and then them engage in like two months. And it's like... Yep. Or, or, or I'm breeder. Yeah, like... <laughs> but maybe, you can look at it this way, you know? maybe he was just not for you. Or maybe he just wasn't happy. Oh yeah. And then but some you know, like but just I, I, don't, I don't know what to Just to shut the mouth of these leaves also. What? Hmm? What, you say? what you say? She's saying that like some people are marrying others like just to shut them up. Like you're in a relationship oh, wow. and... You yeah. never see that quote on Instagram yeah. yet that no, I'm saying? I gave her the ring just to shut... Like... Yeah. A girl saying, aren't you engaged? Oh, I just gave her the ring too buy me some time but how are you doing though? You never see that mean? Wow. People getting married for the wrong reason. Exactly. Yeah. And then it's like the marriages nowadays are so short. Because women aren't settling for less these days also. So when our grand like you never see that too? Yeah. When our grandmother would go through the abuse, no one would let them. Yes, yeah, so, yeah, that's true. But but the thing is, because everybody is being so hard headed and you know, I play tough and whatever, it's like when stuff happen, it's like they must say, alright, my gone. Instead of probably trying to work yeah. stuff out, yeah. so it's like nobody wants to work stuff out anymore. It's just like mm -hmm. divorce. You miss me, my gone. Alright, my not take this. And that is why I will say that. Yeah, but that is why it is so important to see the person in all of their aspects in life. When them rich, when them broke, when them happy, when them go through a death. Like you need to see them in every stage of them life. So you can know if you you want to deal with this for the rest of your life. But some people, the thing is, not some people as in a marriage they still think as individuals. I mean, you're individual, but at the same time, remember ah, you're a unit. No. You have to, no. you know, gel with each other. And a lot of people not gelling. Yeah, hold on. Ah. Stay oh. over there. Okay, hold on. <laughs> just calm down, just calm down. And that should have been the first time, you know? Oh, man. Open. <laughs> you're good, you're fine. Just calm down, just calm down. Okay, so the thing says What thing? That we're about to discuss Oh The summer no river? Oh my god! Okay, so it says Please hide my name My husband found me in bed with another man in our bedroom 
I expected him to shoot both of us right there, but he didn't. He nicely asked my side guy to get dressed and leave. I was shaking to the toe at that moment. He told me to go take a shower and I tried to apologize but he told me he didn't want to talk about it because there was nothing he can do to reverse what had happened. That was the last time we spoke about it. Ever since that day, he has been nice to me. He buys me flowers and he takes me out at least twice a week. Just last week, he took me shopping and spent... This says R4400, so enough money. He's busy organizing a vacation for us overseas before Christmas. My husband is doing everything I want from a man. Here's my problem. What he saw last month is eating me every day, especially since he doesn't want to talk about it. I'm even losing weight. Um, I expected him to chase me away, punish me, or call a family meeting to report me. He's doing the opposite. I feel like he's planning to do something bad to me. Sometimes I open my eyes at night and find him looking at me. When I ask, he says he's admiring my beauty and thanking God for, for blessing him with a flame of a woman. I think he's planning to do something to me when we're overseas. Am I being unnecessarily paranoid? Should I be worried? Yes, ma'am! Like, what do you think? I feel like, listen, I feel like... You know, I can have some time. Yes. The comments, somebody does say, she should remove herself from that relationship before she ends up in the grave. Somebody said, to be honest, that's, right. the, that's the punishment, the guilt, shame, and fear. All he's doing is just to multiply her guilt. Somebody else said, so? maybe, but his reaction can be real. When my ex first cheated, I went into overdrive, True. desperate to show her it could work, that she didn't need anyone else. She had the same reaction. This lady will cheat again, not because she wants to, but because she will need some normalcy. Seriously? Right? <laughs> what kind of normalcy is like? Really? There's, there's nothing okay with like normal never, about cheating. Exactly. They never, they never forget about it. I don't know, I and the, this next person said, You feed and take care of a whole chicken before you cheat it for it. That's so, true. <laughs> and I heard that, I was like, Ooh. Listen. Yeah, and the person was saying, There are two angles to, the, to this thing. He might, he might be thinking that you cheated on him because he wasn't caring and loving or giving you enough attention. And the other one is he might just want to let things slide and give you payback when you less expect it. Be a tolerant. Me feel like he might go do our son because the fact is he didn't even want to talk about it because. If it's a case where oh he wants to show her that you know him can change and he can be the man that she actually wants and you know like he's trying to give her reasons for her not to cheat again, there should have at least been a conversation between the two of them where he was expressing her. So my right. weird and all the time all them, right. them, and they suck at communication. Um, uh, at least well. That just weird, and then the fact that he's looking at her while she sleeps. No, yeah, no, no, no. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That that not sit well with me at all. Can't. Mm, I like it here. Yeah, like we feel like because me cheat on you, and then all of a sudden you just like to start showing me with gifts and start carrying me out and I stay by me when I sleep. No. Listen. That's weird. Sometimes look on her Will Smith when he finally said she did in a situation she I mean, sure at least he cried. Oh please, you don't know about the man do behind closed doors. You don't know that. I love it. So what do you think, Jada and uh what's your name? I don't Carian. even know if she here, she's probably sleeping. Mm -hmm. yeah, so oh sleepy. my gosh, she was sleeping! <laughs> <laughs> I have it. Yeah. She should run. Why are you making the fans like that? Oh. With the fan in your hand. You do what in your hand? You have the tile in your hand. So? No, sis. This is how I take it up sometimes. That's why I find them no look good. <laughs> I'm gonna know where I do.
<laughs> okay, fine. Let me just do it with my mom. Simple. Jeez. Oh Voice notes. <laughs> okay, I'm going to listen to them. Please. <laughs> 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 you know, they're my experience. Is it about the, the taxi man or um, people? I'm not going to listen to the two But I think I saw something kidnapping. Oh my god, at Christmas time. Mm -hmm. Why don't I go? Elsewhere with that. Oh my god, I don't love that for you. I don't love that for all of you. Is it a Spanish song now? No, girl. I was watching, I was listening to it. Yesterday, we need to know because it's Serena and it seems us. Yesterday, one of the janitors that um, we were at work, just as I saw her co worker and asked her for her, and she said, I'm trying to get her all morning. And she not answering her phone. I don't know what happened because I don't hear from her. Nobody I call her, they can't get her. Something must happen. There she step up on the step to come in the building. And I said, See her there. Virgin, the lady was abducted mm -hmm. on Mountain View Avenue. She went in this pro box taxi. And as she went in there, she heard this is a rock we don't move. And she looked in there four other ladies was in there you understand she was bound her hand was bound her face was covered and they robbed her they took her to portmore here in portmore took her here in portmore and clean out her account and then let her go she said another lady in there was screaming like crazy and they kept beating her she said she didn't know what to her she said a nurse was in there and two other girls in there work at a call center. She said when she left out of the vehicle, they never let them go yet because no money not reaching for them account yet. So she don't know what becomes of them. She said them let her go in a portmore. She don't know where in a portmore them let her go. I walk, she a walk and she saw one lady. And she stopped the lady and tell the lady what and the lady get a taxi and get her five hundred dollars and she come so she could get to come. Virgin be vigilant, be careful on the road. These guys are serious. We choose them in the work and we go in at the department and we hear this guy talk. I mean, you know, may I hear a bit of the conversation, but through me, I think in our home, we never really. And yesterday, me know say he live up in Kansas Spring area. Them powder him, rub him, lift off the grill off his window, lift off his window, and go in pan him, rub him blind. You understand and that is up in Constance Spring. Remember, I share a video with you guys. That was in Spanish town. It comes up couple communities in a Spanish town. Them guys are serious. We have to be vigilant. So I tell my daughter, so listen, man, when you're on the road, as you go in your vehicle, make sure that your vehicle are closed because that's what they're doing. Once you go into the vehicle, they might come up to you. You understand? And they might pull them gun on you. So as you go in your vehicles, please, ladies, Rock close door. the doors. Make sure all your doors are closed. Don't make nobody walk up to you as if they know you greet as if you know them. You understand me? Don't make nobody pat you or touch you. Be suspicious of everybody. It may sound funny as women of God, but listen. Be suspicious of everybody because these guys are not playing. 
keep water in your house at night, especially if you're living, you're a single woman living. What? These guys are not playing. So I pray I'll spoil your day. So enjoy the rest of your day. God bless you. What was the one? What about She's not the first person in here to say that. But why? What was the scenario? Make other person tell you to keep water in your house. Something like some um. My grandmother did always do it to put a glass of water under the bed. I don't remember why. I you turn my use spirit or something? But I saw a door. I'm not sure. Honestly, and she she hung corn in the kitchen. She said, "So your house will never be out of food." Hung corn and bread. You hang the corn and the bread. Mm -hmm, and bread. You put bread over your wing, um, over the door. So she said, money will always be in the house, and food. You know, the corn signifies food will always be in the house, or something like that. So, old people. Yeah, I know. Well, I'm gonna listen to the next one. Mommy, she know. Her and I don't know. Evil. Or the supermarket. That's two minutes at least. Wait, wait, wait. Move your hand. Hello? 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 Your mom said you better come home now. <laughs> oh, you're so weird. She just says she wants you to be with the earth, not for Papa. You know, like she just wants to know you're safe, you did it with her. And we did the lash box, don't you know? No. A lot of stickies right here, man, like, come on, yo. When did you see the lash them stick on? Why you gotta put them on for? It don't make sense. Don't stop doing foolishness. You understand? If it don't stick on, don't keep it on. You understand? Just like Imagine in your own house and make exactly. up and see nothing at all. Yeah, at the video when the girl did I say um them breaking and drug her parents and her grandma and she was in the room and then she found money and food and all that stuff. Then drug her grandmother. Cold and then sweet Oh wow. Wow. And she heard the noise and she got up and she said like something just to her. So she said, what can you do She said, what can you do 
and then pulling the rear off on the front end to take off the rear end. Guys, please be careful. Like, it's no joke. <laughs> you lied! <laughs> you lied! You lied! Honestly, what's the only thing you put on some? Speed! You look like a freak! Woo! I'm gonna put it in the family car. Alarm. I love the truck, I forgot to find it, but. Is it expensive? Yes. No, it's like expensive. Mm -hmm. But then again, a lady have one on her car and something with a kill switch and then burn her car. What? Mm -hmm. And the kill switch became them like the car fire in Olama. Then take it from Port Morning and then shut it down in Olama and then shut it down and burn the car. You see, because they don't work, they don't do an honest work, they don't even work, period. So you can't tell a little story when they get born. Shit! Everybody knows that story there, really. So just one time when they never get born? Two? Whoa, Shafala. I don't love that for you. I think you need to get more born in your life today. It makes you stronger as an individual. No, but it make me stronger. It builds your strong. character. No, I'm already strong. I need no more. But anyway, guys, I don't get no bonus. My vagina is too good. Where's the um, acetone? So, um, Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. You didn't have to, but she did. And I'm grateful. And I will see you in my next vlogmas because this girl is... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, sis. Y'all follow me at all socials at. She's gonna link it down here. Am I? Right you better so. say it so people can know how to find you. Follow me at all socials at. Marley Petit. M A R L E Y Y underscore Petit. So what happened to this page? Alright! Wow! <laughs> And you can follow my business page at bearskin j a bear underscore skin j a. Book me for all your waxing needs. So if you want your coochie to wax up and everything, I'm your girl. Okay. Hello.